Okay, I've just received a package which is a Xenot 12 240 volt pure sine wave inverter. It can supply continuous 600 watts of power and an Anderson to double Anderson adapter. I've already got power at the back of the vehicle. Probably the guy before me had a fridge, I'd say. So that's a 50 amp Anderson plug. Hopefully it will be able to run the fridge and this inverter which I'm about to install. Anyway, let's see how it goes. So I'm just mounting the screws for the front, then it'll be mounted. I've just got to connect the Anderson plug to the one that's been already run through to the back of the car. It's nice and secure. So there's the Anderson plug. Just got to go around the back and get that sorted out. So I've connected the inverter up to the uh, Anderson plug that's already coming out of the vehicle. That's some of the previous owners run that back here for a fridge probably. But I've got also a double Anderson here so I can run the fridge and the inverter possibly. I don't know what the current's going to be but we'll find out. Anyway for now I'll just give the inverter a try. First thing we'll do, now it's wired up, we'll see if it goes on. It goes on, okay. That's the start, isn't it? Turn up. So we'll plug that in there. But you can see that the charging thing is on anyway. Plug it back in again. Yeah, so it's charging. So it's charging the iPad. Now that's the location of the uh, inverter behind my draw unit and on top of the uh, other cabinet. Yeah, so it's charging all right. And I think the position here behind my shelf unit and then when the back seat is down, it'll be out of the way. So I think it's a good position and it's working fine. Thanks for watching. See you next time.